My name is uh, Tarek Hadhad and I am the CEO and, and founder of Peace by Chocolate now in Antigonish, Nova Scotia. Peace by Chocolate is more than a cause than a business. Uh, the whole company really started on the idea of spreading peace as a power to change the world and to change the way really people think about understanding our differences, about for, forgiving ourselves, about celebrating uh, our, our diversity in this country and also to change the whole way that people think about all of these newcomers and they are coming to this country as they are contributors, as they are not here to take, but they are here to add. We came to Canada in 2015 on the pilot to bring 25,000 Syrian newcomers to Canada at that time. So we were the first actually to land in this country after living our entire life in Damascus, Syria. At the time where Damascus was very well known for the civilization, for the level of culture and acceptance, for the others. Now we are again in an open country uh, that accepts everyone regardless of their religion, of the place that they come from, their background, of their ethnicity, of their culture, where everyone is really welcome. I believe in sharing stories. I believe in the power of sharing stories because it's your responsibility in the first place to be the ambassador for your culture, for your thoughts, for your opinions, for your achievements even. That's exactly how I'm feeling right now. I'm feeling that I'm an ambassador for a mission and uh, a big global movement towards understanding more peace, which is one of the noblest value on earth. So today I had the honor to be at the Global Youth Forum at um, CG here in Waterloo, speaking to hundreds of uh, senior high school students about the importance of understanding the, uh, the whole global scale about all of these immigrants that they are uh, trying to find a place for themselves and their family. The youth in this time are the most privileged generations because the accessibility to information is massive. You can get any information that you need to build on it and create ideas and innovation and be different and remarkable. And some of them, they take it for granted. They say that, you know, this is happening because they are living in that age. Some of them, they are now trying to make the real change and take that wave to another level, to the help and support for the entire humanity because they believe that it is absolutely the, the time where the millennials, they have the, the ability right now to make um, a great change that will impact all the, the humanity for generations to come.